What's up guys, it's Blake and today I'm back with day two of summer 17 and right now to start off this vlog we're leaving for Chicago uh, in like 10 minutes the uh, Uber's on the way but I had to show you my latest pickup to get this vlog started. Okay guys, so this is a, a very very expensive sneaker pickup. I was going to show you yesterday but I felt like it would be good to show today just because it's something for you guys to look forward to. So as you guys can see here, we have the Pharrell box. So guys, there's a size tag, and you guessed it, it is a size 11, my size, in a Pharrell NMD. This is not any normal NMD, this is, obviously, it's a Pharrell human race. And then when we look on the box right here, it says to Marcus from Pharrell with some smiley face. And this is signed by Pharrell to a family member, it's Marcus, I don't know, but these are the friends and family Pharrell NMDs. These are pretty crazy, guys, look at these. They're rumored to be, I think, 30 to 40 pairs, maybe. These are really, really limited. I'm super happy I was able to get these. I, I'm just gonna be honest with you guys straight up. Uh, Urban Necessities had one of these yesterday for 8.5K, and that's without tax. Flight Club has them for, I think, 10 or 12. I got these for six. They're dead stock, and I did get them from a plug who I know. Um, very legit, so I'm not even doubting if these are real or fake. I got a steal. I think that's like a steal of the century. Just because like I saved myself like four or five K at least at some places like Flight Club. Eight point five K is already a really good price because like I know what these go for. Like at Urban SSCs, that's a really good price. But uh yeah, I just got a really, really good price on these. These are really crazy. The material up on the upper is a little bit different than the other pairs we sort of compared it it has like a different font i'm not sure what it means it may just mean human race but uh yeah i'm really happy i got these i know a lot of people that were willing to buy me or buy these off me right when i got them for like way more than i paid so if i ever like want to get rid of these or i'm like i don't know i just don't need these anymore i can get rid of them but yeah i think i'm gonna be wearing these a lot sneaker con la uh, they have like the whole size thing, extra laces. Everything else is pretty much the same though. It's just a regular box. I was talking to Zach last night. I wish they did like something crazy with the box. But uh, yeah, they didn't. So I think that's also sort of cool because it just keeps it like all the others. So I'll be able to have these and all the others, like the normal colors. I'm not buying the, the pink pair though too much. But uh, yeah, super happy with these. And yeah, we're going to get today started. It's like... Guys, it's like 7.30 a.m. right now. I just took a shower, put some stuff in my hair. It may look like really stuck up. But uh, we're going to LAX right now, and then we are going to head on our way to Chicago. We have uh, some things we gotta do tonight. It's like a player meeting or something. So guys, we're at the airport right now. We're about to check in. This is a private label, uh, limited edition sneaker duffel. It has all my sneakers in here that we're gonna be wearing. So I'm gonna be taking this on the flight with us. It's super heavy. And then we got that full of merch, that full of merch. And then this is our clothes, this little one. The flight, how long is the flight? Four or five hours? Four hours. Four hours, so I'm gonna get to edit yesterday's vlog. I was trying to edit it last night, but I'm really trying to like spend more time editing just because I'm trying to like make better content for you guys. So I'm gonna spend like probably half of the flight, like two hours editing yesterday's vlog, the first day of uh, summer 17. Guys, so we're waiting to check our bags in right now. The flight's in like 45 minutes, so we're pretty good on time, but we wish there was a little more time so we could go eat and get some food. But yeah, we're gonna probably get in at five o'clock in Chicago. There's a player meeting I gotta attend at six. I just wanna shoot a little bit the day before just to get some shots in and just, I don't know, get comfortable with the court and the balls that we're using. So yeah, we'll see. I got a lot to edit on this vlog. This isn't gonna be the craziest vlog, but it'll be cool, so. That's why I wanted to make sure I showed you guys those shoes at the beginning, just to add something like spicy, you know, in case we don't end up doing anything. Guys, so we're still in line. I decided to crack open the sneaker duffel bag and see what we got going here. 
So pretty much these are the KD4 nerfs. This is what I'm playing in for both games, the Hoops Classic and the Rookie game. Um, I don't know why they call it just the Rookie game. I should call it Rookie Hoops Classic game. I don't even really know what it's called, but yeah, these are the shoes that I'm wearing. This is a size 11 KD4 nerf. I, I traded my size, uh, size 10 for these because they were a little small. So if you check Michelangelo, such a nice shoe. The funny thing about those is like, I was planning on wearing these like a month ago to Chicago because like I booked this ahead and like I planned it out ahead. But actually, which is really funny, uh, yesterday I saw something on Instagram talking about KD on how he wants to retro these, like re-release them to the public. And I don't think these ever did release to the public. I think it was like an auction or charity thing. That's why they're like so limited. But there was something saying like, oh, KD, if he possibly wins a championship or something, wants to start retroing, and this would be like the first one they do. And I'm thinking like, no, 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 don't do that. Just because I paid a lot for these, and they're a lot because they never released. So, uh, yeah, I don't know. These are really dope though. They're really comfortable, and uh, they're lightly used, but we're gonna get good wear out of them. Get some good play time in them, hopefully if I play it all. Guys, look at how much luggage we have. Yeah, guys, honestly, I think I'm always just gonna leave this mic on, even if it dies, just because I keep forgetting to put the mic on in it, like so. But anyway, yeah, we've been waiting in line for a while. Guys, I had like a small feeling we may have missed this flight, but we did, so we're good. Yeah, our hotel is connected to the convention center. So right now it's about six o'clock. It's like 5.50. We are going to the sneaker con area right now, the convention. And we are, uh, we are having a little meeting for the, the main game. And I, I guess it's pretty much just like everybody gets to meet each other because it's a lot of guys like that I, I haven't met. And then I guess we're doing a little shoot around. So I got my shoes and my backpack. My dad's here. We got a nice room. We put all the stuff in it. We unpacked and stuff. Guys, this is huge. This is like the whole entrance to the convention center. This is crazy. I cannot wait to see the court. It's gonna be really, really cool. I don't know. I'm guessing it's over there because that looks like it's a wedding or something. I'm gonna run, I'm so excited. Woo! Guys, I'm so excited. We're in Chicago right now just so I can be at a secret show. I never would have realized this would have happened. Is this it? <sighs> Damn. Yo, this is crazy. It's crazy. This event's gonna be nuts. Yo guys, so this is the court for SneakerCon. Check this out. Oh my God, this is crazy. Look at this, this is ridiculous. We've got bleachers everywhere. All the tables are gonna be over here. It's like some type of thing in the middle. Trading pit. This is crazy. Guys, so I just put the kicks on. KD4 nerf. <laughs> How are you? Thank you. Yeah, this is this is crazy. This is crazy. This is so Fire kicks in Chicago. How you doing? Making it a little more windy, huh? Uh, yeah. Yes, sir. Yes. Who wants to buy it? All of a sudden, we out here. Ah! 
Okay, so guys, if okay, you haven't so. heard, the twins are on the same team, me, Blake and Blake. We're gonna be killing it tomorrow. We're gonna take over rookie game, you already know. Guys, so check out our booth right here. Yeah, there's, there's so many there's people. 25. So many people have asked me out of town, like, yo, can you say one? Dude, like everyone's asking for him. Hey, the only thing I can say to people out of town, just check eBay. Yeah, after. I just check I, eBay. I bet low key these are gonna have resale. They're so tight, dude. Good meeting. Good practice. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Uh, ooh, ooh, ooh. Thanks for coming <laughs> and uh, sneaker con on three. One, I'm two, so three. Sneaker con! Oh, no way. These are the pep no bismol ones. Do you ever think that like this would be your life? You're what? You're 15, right? Okay, so I was walking here into the thing and I literally said, I said, guys, I would never expect that I would fly all the way to Chicago, somewhere far across the country, just to go to a sneaker event. And, and then think people. about then think about people running up to us and then selling hundreds of shirts and then playing in a game of a basketball you game. Selling hundreds of shirts, merch plug. Yeah. Merch plug. <laughs> Bro, Jake Paul's popping right now. Do you watch him? No. So pretty much like Chicago is known for pizza. At least that's what my pop says. Yes, so yeah. we're gonna try to uh, we're gonna try to get some good pizza tonight. You know. So I don't have that much light in this room, but pretty much today was super fun. I got to go to Chicago. I'm at Chicago right now. We were able to get ready for sneaker con. I got to play a little bit of basketball, so I feel more comfortable for tomorrow. Um, I know my jump shot's broke, so for anybody that's, I don't know, yeah, this is obviously gonna be posted later. Yeah, pretty much anybody that's gonna be there tomorrow, I can't wait to see you guys. I'm playing in the rookie game. It's going to be crazy. I cannot wait. So I really appreciate all the support. We're at the hotel that's connected to the convention center, and literally, Every single kid that's in here has come up to me, just showed so much love. Either taking a pic, saying what's up. So I really do appreciate it. The support is crazy, guys. A lot of people ask me about this hoodie. I don't know if you guys can see because it's really dark in here. A lot of people ask me about this. They're like, looking to cop. It will not be available at Chicago. I will have my collab merch and stuff with Blake Wynn, Just Wynn Sneakers. So I'm gonna end this vlog right now. I appreciate your guys' support. I love you guys and thank you for all your recent support and I will see you guys for day one of SneakerCon Chicago tomorrow. So, we're out of here. Peace.